Well, we are looking here at thousands of millions of years of uh, geological evolution. Actually, if this place would be on Mars, uh, that would be fantastic because if I would pick just any arbitrary rock like, like this one or, well, not that one, but maybe right there, I can identify uh, already fossils. I mean, that would be one of the proofs of life we would have on Mars. I we don't expect them to be there, but during the uh, Mars 2013 mission, we are looking into the microscopic and chemical trace of life which might have been extinct on Mars. So we are using this area here in uh, Morocco as kind of a testing ground for our instrumentation, for our scientific workflows. With Mars 2013 and the lead of the Austrian Space Forum, we are unifying 23 nations, more than 100 people from all continents except Antarctica, to be part of this human endeavor, preparing future human Mars missions. moment right now we are doing a reconnaissance which means we're looking for places where later the astronauts will go and looking for uh, will be looking for trace of life on a molecular basis the idea behind this is that we are basically replacing part of the orbital reconnaissance you would have for Mars and do some on-site reconnaissance to be sure that you are at the right place this is something very important also for Mars you just can't go everywhere and you shouldn't go everywhere because there's only probably a few spots where it's so interesting that it's worthwhile dispatching a multi-billion dollar mission. And the idea we are following here is that we're not only working with astronauts, but we are combining robotic partners. So human-robotic partnerships is one of the main goals of Mars 2013.